Soaring fuel prices and epileptic power supply, a Nigerian inventor Muhammad Adamupaguji has upgraded a solar power generator. He invented to generate 35, 350 watts of electricity. Paguji, who is a graduate of applied physics from the Pupakar Tabak Baliwa University, Boji, says solar energy is the solution to the Nigeria's fuel crisis and epileptic power supply. Ibrahim Ismail reports. Since the removal of fuel subsidy by the federal government, Nigerians have been battling with high cost of petrol to power vehicles and electricity generation due to epileptic power supply in the country. Passionate to provide solutions to the energy crisis, Muhammad Adamu Fagudi, who studied physics, has invented a solar power generator which he recently upgraded to supply both direct and alternative power. I invented this. A device which is called a portable solar generator and I call it dual purpose solar generator because it produces both AC and DC electricity at the same time. We can use it to power AC appliances and DC appliances to simultaneously. Uh, the idea of before I constructed one AC generator, solar AC generator, that one can only power AC appliances, such as television, AC bulbs, AC pans, all varieties of AC appliances. But this one is like an upgraded version of that first generator I invented in 2021. This one is a dual purpose solar generator because as I said earlier, it can be used to power DC and AC appliances simultaneously. The young Nigerian inventor said apart from being affordable, solar energy is environmentally friendly, which can help mitigate the impact of climate change. And I think the best way to do that is to go for sustainable source of electricity. And that is why I selected these solar uh, gadgets, because in solar, you know, the solar, uh, sol solar source, or we can say the solar electricity, is the environmentally friendly source of electricity and it doesn't emit carbon because we don't use fuel here this generator you can you, you don't need to buy fuel and you can see now that the subsidy the fuel subsidy is removed so the the price is so high in such a way that ordinary people cannot afford to buy faguji who called on the federal government to invest in solar energy is looking forward to develop his invention for safe reliance. Ibrahim Ismail, Trust TV News, Gombe.